Hey everybody, it's Blue Toad, and welcome back to some more Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity. Last time, we finished off the last main battle that we did. And this time, we've got quite a lot of flashing yellow spots on our map. So we're going to have to start taking some of those out. We're not going to be able to get through... like We're going to run out of materials fairly quickly. But starting off, I want to get over here... A stasis on research. Researchers are trying to develop an upgrade for stasis have, have come up empty-handed. Guiding parts might give them a hint, but how could they possibly obtain those? You did well. Within days of receiving the ancient materials, researchers announced a new upgrade for stasis. More than the items themselves, your show of support had made all the difference. Reduce time between using sta uh, stasis. Cool. So stasis recharge is going to be faster, which is going to be really useful. And now, let's have a look at some other things. Uh, I believe there was one thing that I really wanted to do, which is over here. Caring for the statues. A Garuda craftsman, a uh, craftswoman, devoted to the... Uh, preservation of those of the heroine statues has created a new method for their care. Find what she needs to preserve uh, those stone sentinels of the desert. Good going. The Gerudo craftswoman did her preservation work ex expertly on every f uh, f I don't faucet of the statues. After seeing her new method, you could possibly remove a weapon's seals. So, if we now go over to the blacksmith and go to remove seals, instead of always removing all the seals, we can remove one seal which means we can get rid of the high resell weapon because we really don't need to be able to resell the, the 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 sword but we also need materials oh my goodness i didn't realize this was going to be a, a thing but that's probably a good trade-off it's probably fair oh my goodness also it's interesting that the hearty truffles i didn't realize they would mushroom um let me just get a root of Hylian Shroom, probably. Some meat. Um, guess raw bird thigh can work. Monster parts. How many monster parts do we need? 30. This is very expensive, but it's useful. Ah, uh, What do I want to get rid of? I don't really want to get rid of any monster parts. They're useful. I'll go Moblin Horn. Or maybe... No, I, I can I can do all of it. And now, for the worst one of all. Trophies, because we need lots of trophies. Let me just do all the Coblin. I'm s sad to let them go, though. Because they're really useful. There we go. High reset weapon is gone. Oh my goodness. Let me try to fuse something that will be useful into it now. Uh, I had some text on screen a few episodes ago saying that you should be careful of what uh, weapons you sell when you have the... You need to look at the effects when you sell a weapon. So that's very important. Damage per 100 KOs plus 4%. That's pretty good. Sensor requ requ registered material drop rate plus 15%. That's probably a a very good effect that you should have on something, but I don't think it's the Master Sword. XP per battle, Ancient Part drop rate, Fire Rush damage plus 13%. That's also pretty good. Oh, it has two effects, wow. Oh, that's because it's merged, cool. Uh, Mid-air attack, strong attack damage, damage from enemies. What would work well with a Master Sword? Also, if the effects is just a plus sign, that means that that specific weapon can have effects merged into it. 
I'm pretty sure, but I'm pretty sure that no weapon doesn't have a plus on it, maybe. But just basically saying that it's empty. Damage per 100 KOs or something else. Damage at 30% hearts or less gets 12%. What do I want for this? I'm pretty sure there was something that I thought was really good. And it might be damage per 100 KOs. I think there were two. Also, that's not the way you merge items or weapons. So I'll select that. And there was one other one that had the exact same effect, but I can't remember what. Did that just cancel the whole thing? It did. So there's that one. And then there's... That one. Okay. Let's do both of those. 600 rupees. There we go. Master Sword should have some pretty good stuff now. I don't know how much work I want to put into that. But anyway, I'm going to leave that for now. Let's have a look at some other things like this. Shiny new tools. The Blacksmith Guild needs new tools because their old ones are nearly worn out after years of use. But they don't have enough money. Uh, they don't have the money for any. Help the gar uh, guild... Find the funds. Bravo. Superb. With their shiny... With their tools, the blacksmiths are like little kids with new toys. That also means they, they're more productive than ever, swinging away with their weapon forging strength. Hylian Blacksmith Guild discount 5%. That's pretty good. You received an offer of help from the finest blacksmith in the kingdom. She says she can upgrade your armor for the battles ahead, as long as you bring her a couple of monster parts and a trophy. Amazing. The blacksmith reinforced your armor, though it looks no different than before. It is easier to move around in and, ma and more resistant to incoming attacks. Reduce em enemy damage by 5%. That's useful. It's not a lot, but it's we've been having a lot of trouble being smacked in the face with enemies. So, lots of the glowing spots are no, no longer flashing. That's concerning. I really am just going to have to look for materials all over the world. I want to focus on these icons, though, because they seem to be just general upgrades for the world. F uh, Flora Bridge Protection. Travelers won't cross Flora Bridge because fl uh, Farish flies... Uh, through every... Oh, for... Yeah, the thing. Flies through every now and then. Bring supplies that will ke help keep traders or travelers safe on this bridge crossing. A wonderful Thanks to your supplies and support, word got out that Floria Bridge is safe to cross. Merchants are now able to roam Eastern Hyrule more freely, which will... Uh, help the region flourish. Discount in Eastern Hyrule, 10%. That's useful. Also, I'm very concerned that we haven't even reached these percentages for things. What's this one? 51. They're all fairly high percentages, though. Like, halfway to 100, so. What about this one? 55. Yeah, it's still like 40 to like 60 so I guess that's all right then 35 though 30 35 come on uh, let's see I want to have a look at wait no do I want stable it might mean that I could have good merchant stuff oh I have no idea what I want to do this is probably fine oh there's just so many things. I should just work my way across everything. So, wedding worry. A stable owner has shut down his stable because of his wedding. That is because he's having a galloping ca uh, case of jit jitters about the whole thing. Find something to calm him down. <laughs> Thanks to the soothing nature of the field herbs. The stable owner was able to calm down and look forward to the big day. He reopened his stable too. 
Easter Color Stable is now available. Also, we got this, apparently. Okay. New stable. Not a light meal. A Goron architect has been summoned to Hebra to help with fort repairs. Might be a long trip, he says. Sure, hope it. I don't get hungry on the way. Bring him a snack for the road. Bringing along his snack lunch packed with ore, the architect did a superb job fixing up uh, fort, the fort in Hebra. In fact, he finished the job ahead of schedule. Yonobo gets an extra X combo. And also we get amber earrings because we're just getting earrings at the moment for some reason. Now, is anything still glowing? Yes, just, just a few. Joint training with the Rito. The Rito have asked you to help them train for the, the uh, decisive battle against Calamity Ganon. Before you depart for Rito Village, pack some materials to ins ensure the exercise goes smoothly. I refuse to be anything with plenty of resources at their disposal, the Rito training exercises were a great success. In return for your aid, they committed to proving additional help, providing additional help in the decisive battle. Zelda's Ball of Light gets an extra Y combo. Oh, come on. Research materials. Lately, Zelda has spent all day and night working in her study. Her waiting maid says that uh, the princess is yearning for certain hard to find research samples. This seems a bit out of the story, but anyway. With the rare monster parts on hand, Princess Zelda's research progressed by leaps and bounds. Who knew that such dangerous materials would turn out to be so useful? Zelda gets two more hearts, which is just increasing so much. Zelda has so many hearts now. Oh, something else opening. But we can't do that yet. Research funding. The researchers have an uh, ambitious idea for the next experiment, but they're sorely lacking in funds. They need to make it happen. Help them scrape some, uh, together some cash. I refuse to be anything when you announce the good news, the lab erupted in with cheers. Now we can pull off the experiment for sure. You felt certain the researchers would put your donation to good use. Zelda Sheik is like an extra X, X, X combo. And Central Hyrule levels up. Very nice. I don't think any of those materials are needed for quests. Probably. Not in large amounts though. Probably. At the, at the very least. Okay. Armor for whom? And a client who wishes to be anonymous has noticed his daughter staying up late into the night. Crafting armor for someone. Worried for her health, he asks for a supply of energizing food. Foods. I am the client's daughter completed the armor without uh, incident and in good health. Still, he could not help but wonder to whom she in intended to give the item. Mifa gets an extra special bar. And we also get the Zora Greaves. These Zora, uh, these Greaves have been passed down among the Zoro for generations. It's been said they're crafted using dragon scales. They reportedly increase the wearer's swim speed, except it doesn't because it's not not in this game. It's just for looks in this game. But anyway, we are still running out of things to do. Joint training with the Gerudo. You invited. You're invited to train to join the Gerudo as they practice for the fight against Calamity Ganon. They uh, like to feast before they train, so bring along some special cooking ingredients. I've done it. The meal left the Gerudo satisfied and raring to go. They threw themselves into the training with gusto, pleased. Uh, Chief Obosa promised to lend them, lend even more Gerudo support in the final battle. Zelda gets an extra X combo. Uh, 
Uh, chili. Oh, I don't even know how to pronounce that word. Uh, Sitka. Ah, uh, I would have to look it up. Master Koga plans to eat Ice Cube so he can harden his body and spirit and achieve his truest, manliest form. But he needs warm stuff to settle his stomach and syrup to flavor the ice. Now I'm even more charming. No. Master Koga could feel his body and his spirit hardening, but he could also feel an uncomfortable ch a churn in his stomach. Gah, perhaps he shouldn't have mixed cold ice with warm ingredients. Master Koga gets an extra Y combo. Let me just quickly look up the word so I can figure out how to pronounce it. Asceticism, I think. Severe self-discipline and avoiding of all forms of indulgence, typically for religious reasons. So that's what that means. You learn... There's just so many words I've never heard before in this game for some reason. This game very specifically. And I don't know why. Fine bites for... from Lurin Village. A fisherman born in Lurin Village wants to introduce you to its signature dish, but he needs one more ingredient. He'll teach you the recipe if you can find uh, that for him. You get the, master the fisherman grilled the fish and then rolled it up in steaming Hylian rice. What a clever little recipe, and what great big flavor. Now the secrets of making seafood rice bowls is yours. There we go. Let me just quickly... Okay, I'm gonna need some of that, probably, since it's a heart icon. Probably important. And now, what else should I mark as needing to do? Oh, well, there's a thing here. Let me mark that. And anything else that looks important? I guess this thing. Needing some monster parts from all over the place. Okay then, we now have a few goals in mind, but there's just so many things left to do. But I think starting off, let's go into, into anti-ice training 2 that we've already completed. For reasons. As you can see on the, board, the info there, there's a Korok in here. So let's go try and find it. And I think I already found it when I was running a few items earlier. Okay, here we go. Just need to fight a few ice moblins and then we'll be able to do it. So, let's... Oh, I don't have any fire element, but that's fine. Let me just dodge out of the way of that and then let's also use our stasis because that's going to take less time to recharge now. Which means we can use it a whole lot more to get extra hits in on people's weak points. Oh, I missed completely with that one. Oh, but I can stasis. We can also make sure we stasis after using a rune already, so that's also useful. Anyway, let's finish up this ice molden. Just like this. We're a bit overpowered since we are several levels above everything here. But that's fine. But anyway, let's actually uh, dodge and stasis everything. And if I can actually use some good combos, I might actually be able to do some decent oh, stuff to the old stasis. No, no stasis, thank you. Do some actual damage to their weak points. Weak point smash. Let's focus on the next one. Oh, stasis. Oh, stasis. Oh, stasis. Oh, stasis. That's... They both need it. Perfect. Oh, here we go. Weak point smash. On that one. Oh, that one. Wow. Okay, then. 
Oh, become massive. Might even hold off on that just for a bit. Okay, you're about to be done. Oh my goodness, he's so done. Wait, oh, put smash. Okay, there we go. And now, if we go out this way, we have some stone pebblet things that we can fight, which will actually be good because we need trophies for them. But if we go, of course, over this way, we can see a rock in this dent here, and I think, I think, no, maybe, bomb, that didn't work at all, um, I think if I can actually figure out how to get it out, probably with stasis, no, am I just, is this actually not it? I feel like it should be, but it might not be. Let me try. Maybe, oh, you know what? It's probably ice. No. Come on. This is... This has got to be something. If it's magnesis... That didn't do anything. Oh, it just doesn't... Okay, it just doesn't do anything. If you do it like that, okay. I have two minutes before I'm going to lose this, so I just don't know how to get that out of the ground. You know? I feel like I should just be able to press a button to get it, but it's not working, so I don't know. That could be the Korok. We haven't seen any Koroks where we get... where we pick up a stone. But I have no idea how to do it, so... I'm in trouble. This is not a great plan. I don't think... Oh, unless it's like way up this way. Half the time limit remains. I'm not going to be able to complete the challenge in time. Oh, but there's... Okay, then. So that rock is just there. Basically. If I go really quickly, I might be able to still win this. Really fast, though. I have to ignore all of the other pebblet stone talus things just lying around the ground. And I also have to take advantage of everything that I have, which is not going to go well. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Become massive. Oh my goodness, stop pushing me into a wall. Become massive. Oh, please, become massive. Weak point smash. Okay, this might work. I doubt it, but it might. I can hit its weak point by becoming massive. Oh, I'm out of thing. That's fine. Oh, I'm strong, which might actually help me a lot. Stasis. That didn't work. That's unfortunate because I don't have my stasis now, and it's just... Ah! Oh, please, oh, please, oh, please, oh, please, oh, please. Weak point smash again. How? I don't even know. I'm just going to accept my win and be amazed. A mere glimpse of my power. I, I'd believe it, considering I just won that somehow. Anti-ice training victory, and I got the Korok as well. How many of the smaller Talos things did I get? And what are they called again? I don't remember. I've just been calling them Peblets or something. Oh, they are Peblet. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Pog. Anyway, that is it for this episode of Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity. So thank you all for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.